It is expected that the railway will cut the cost of transport through Laos by 30 to 40 percent compared to the travel by road, thus giving a boost to trade and investment. The railway runs from through the provinces of Vieng Chan, Luang Prabang, Udom Sai, and Lonam Tha, passing through 75 tunnels. Construction of all of the 10 passenger stations along the Laos China Railway is now complete, with the station in Luang Prabang being the latest to be fully finished. The Laos China Railway Company Limited reported on Tuesday. The station Lung Pabang, some 220 kilometers north of Vieng Chan, was built by the China Railway Construction Group, or CRCG. Lung Pabang Station, which is the second largest on the railway after Vieng Chan Station, consists of two platforms and four tracks, with abundant experience in station construction in China. CRCG engineers combine a classic Chinese style entrance with elements of the Lao National Flower Dok Jampa in the design, while the station's door post, door beams, and facade reflects the aesthetic culture of both countries. For your safety. The Laos China Railway is a docking project between China's Belt and Road Initiative and a Laos strategy to convert itself from a landlocked country to a land link hub. There are 10 passenger stations in Vieng Chan, Pon Hong, Wang Vieng, Ka Si, Long Pa Bang, Nga Sai, Na Mo, Na Tei, as well as 22 freight stations. The 426-kilometer railway runs between Vieng Chan through the provinces of Vieng Chan, Long Pa Bang, Udom Sai, and Long Nam Tha, and ends at the Chinese border in Bo Tien. The railway will significantly boost tourism and trade between Laos, China, and Thailand. To maximize the benefits of the railway, Laos needs to improve human resources to meet the growing needs of the business community. Subaksan Silapet, LNTV English News Team, report.